and welcome back to my channel. My name is Vicki, if you're new here. And for those of you who are returning, thank you so much. I really appreciate all the engagement. I appreciate you answering the question of the video. If you're new here, we have a question of the video at the end of the video. So hang out and see what question we have today. So as the thumbnail says, we're going to be stuffing the fourth week of our sinking funds. And this is Prop Money. I am a part of the Prop Money Millionaire Club. <laughs> I'm part of Miss Alicia's club. Um, and if you're new as well, I have this monthly and weekly budget check-in planner. This is kind of where I do all my draft behind the scenes. Wahaha, ha, magic. <laughs> And I write all my expenses, so on and so forth. And then I also um, have my cash breakdown and put in what denominations I'm going to be using in what envelopes. And I have all of these envelopes in Capital One 360 and I use my credit card. And so as soon as I make a transaction, I come in here week over week. So if you follow me, you know that I show week over week how we use these sinking funds. So let's go ahead and get started. I went ahead and filled in um, the trackers. And so for today, we're gonna be adding $25. So we're doing two tens, two twos, and a one. And so let's go ahead and do that here. All right, so we should have 194 in birthdays. 1, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 85, 87, 89, 90, 91, 92, oh, 93, 94. Okay, I'm not gonna recount that, but it is 194. All right, how is your week been going? I don't recall if I'm putting this on a Friday or Saturday, but when you're seeing this, it'll be the weekend, and we are not around. We're out of town, so we're excited about where we're going. Okay, in Christmas, we're putting in $63, and so we're doing three 20s and three ones. And I have to start Christmas shopping. All right. So we have 2,037, so we have a 1,500, so 15, 16, 17, 20, 40, 60, 80, 18, 20, 40, 60, 80, 19, 20, 40, 60, 80, 2,000, 20, 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So we need a prop swap here pretty soon even though we're gonna start using Christmas here. I'd like to kind of have my, my Christmas envelope fully funded by November, just because I'm gonna you know, start using it and stuff. Um, all right, Haircuts is getting a 15, a 10, and a five. I gotta hurry up, because I gotta go pick up Santiago from school when I'm filming this. Okay, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 1, 10, 15, 21, 121 in haircuts. So I guess I should stop talking and just do what I'm here to do. And plus, if you're like me, I just like watching people stuffing their envelopes anyway. All right, medical is getting 15 and we're doing a 10 and a five. All right, so we have 68, 20, 30, 40, 50, 65, 66, 67, 68. Yeah, I think I'll do a consolidation video here soon. Okay, vacation is getting 25, and we're doing two tens and two twos and two ones. Okay, now we have, we should have 300. 20, 1, 2, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 97, 99, 100. So 300. 
in vacation. All right. Next envelopes are date night. Date night is getting six dollars. And that gets us to 115, 50, 70, 90, 105, 10, 15, 16, 70, 18, 19, 115. Let me see. 50, 70, 50, 70, 90, 100, and 5, 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 15. I don't know how I counted it that first time, but it's fine. Life happens because life happens. <laughs> 1,006, we're gonna be adding $18. So we're doing, let's see, it's a 10, 15, 17, 18, yeah. Okay, so 1,006, 500, 600, 700, 800, 900, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 1,000, 2, 4, 5, 2, 2, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. I knew I was counting that wrong. It's because I'm trying to hurry up. All right. Kids clothes is getting $15. So we're doing a 10 and a 5. And that one will have 162. 1, 20, 40, 50, 55, 60, 1, 2. And kids close. Okay. Kids miscellaneous is getting the same amount for $15. And I'll have 132, 1, 10, 20, 25, 30, 1, 2. And school is getting 25. Oops. So. No, school is getting 15. So it has 1,120, 40, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 2, 93, 1193 in school. Sports is getting 25 today. Yeah. And that is two tens. Two twos and a one. One, two, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, three, twenty, forty, fifty, sixty, sixty two, sixty four, sixty six, sixty seven, sixty eight, sixty nine, three, sixty nine in sports. So now we're getting to the big one. I'll go ahead and take these out, which just makes it easier. Okay, now on to car maintenance. In car maintenance, we have $25 that we're adding. If I can take it out. <laughs> okay, and we're doing two tens, two twos, and a one. And in one we're doing 12 and the other one we're doing 13. So we'll do 12 in maintenance. So that puts us at 331. 1, 2, 50, 70, 90, 
310, 320, 322, 24, 26, 28, 29, 30, 31. 331 in maintenance. Okay, and tires gets the 13. Now we have 1,000, 100, 200, 300, 400, so 14, 20, 40, 50, 60, 65, 67, 69, 71, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, yep, 14, 77 in tires. The goal is to get to, I think it was 3,000, but now we're doing 5,000, maybe. DMB has... What are we putting in DMV today? 25. So we're doing two tens, two twos, and a one. And it'll be one, two, three, 20, 40, 50, 60, 62, 64, 65, 66, 366 in DMV. All right, and then detail. We're not adding to it, but let's count it. It's 478. 1, 2, 3, 4, 20, 40, 60, 70, 75, 76, 77, 78. In detail. All right, so car maintenance goes back. And overall, we have $2,286 in car maintenance. So these are the subcategories within car maintenance. Seasonal activities, that too is one envelope. It has a total of 1,095. We have fall, winter, spring. These are fully funded. Summer and pool is what we're adding to. So we're doing in pool, we're doing $20. So now we have 1, 2, 20, 40, 60, 83, and pull, and then summer, we are doing 25, and, oh, I know what I did wrong. Twenty, twenty-two, twenty-four, twenty-five. One, two, three, four, fifty, four, fifty, four, seventy, four, eighty, eighty-five, eighty-seven, eighty-nine, ninety-one, ninety-two, ninety-three, ninety-four, ninety-five, four, ninety-five in summer. And this just goes towards things that we want to do that's fun. Since Jim is a teacher, I just like to have a little cushion during the summer. Save for that. Okay. Home maintenance is getting, let's see, let's do property taxes first. 125. So we're doing a one. A 20 and a 5. And we're doing 1,000, 1,000, 2,000, 3,000, 4,000, 5,000, 6,000, 7,000, 8,000, 9,000, 10,000, 10,500, 600, 700, 800, 900, 900, and 20, 45. So let's see what we had here. Yep, 10,945. Alright, so it looks like we counted that correctly. Pest. And these are all, all these envelopes are made from Intentional Living, Kristen and Intentional Living. Alright, we're adding 15 to Pest. And that is a 10 and a 5. So it's 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 52, 53. 
in pest. We just made a payment. The bi-monthly, it's like every other month. Okay, and then house, our home maintenance sinking fund is getting 63, right? Yeah, so 320s. 60 and three threes one two three oh maybe I pulled an extra one on accident let's see all right so we've got 1,000 100 200 20 40 60 80 one two three four five yep 1285 Condo, last but not least, is getting 25 today. So we're doing two tens, two twos, and a one. Oh, I did count right. Yay, we have none left over. I don't know what I did last stuffing, guys, but <laughs> okay. 500, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90. 92, 94, 96, 98, 99, 3, 600. So we have $600 and the condo sinking fund. Well, that's exciting. Yay. All right, guys, that is the stuffing for the fourth week. Um, the question of the video is, where is the next place you want to travel on your bucket list and why? So I'll go first. <laughs> the next place we want to travel... Okay, so there's a few things. I, we say bucket list. That doesn't mean like something that's coming up that we know. Because like, I think we're going to do Legoland again this summer. This next summer. But what we want to save for. And I, we need to pay off a few things before we even attempt this. But we want to take the kids to Europe. Um, and we gave ourselves like a three to five year uh, goal for that. Probably closer to five years. But... Um, that's with everything else, you know, getting paid off. So our goal is to pay everything off and then save up to go to Europe and maybe spend, you know, cause gyms off for the summer and so are the kids. Um, and we want to go to Paris. Uh, I want to go to Rome, my favorite city in the whole wide world. And we want to go to Ireland. So we kind of want to do a couple, you know, a few things, maybe a week in each city. Um, I think that's doable. And you don't need a whole week in Rome. Like you could do two days and then do day trips from there. So that's what I did last time when I was single. We, My brother and I traveled through Europe for six weeks and had so much fun. And we spent, we rented a house in Rome for a week. Uh, that was back before Airbnb and we used Craigslist. Um, but it was so much fun. Anyway, let me know what's your next place on your travel bucket list, meaning, you know, it's like a pipe dream, not a pipe dream, but you know, like a really like a stretch goal kind of thing where you're going to be saving up for it and stuff. Not like, oh, we're going to go to Vegas or something. <laughs> I mean, Vegas might be on your bucket list. I don't know, but that's our bucket list is going and taking our kids to Europe. All right, guys. Well, with that, I will see you in the next video. And I'm also part of um, Budgeting April's group, I think the hashtag is OB, oh, I forgot the hashtag, um, but I'm so excited to be part of her group and I will be participating in that next week. So stay tuned for that video as well. All right, I'll see you in the next video. Take care. Bye.